Today, let's look at the Airbus A320 IAE V2500 engine startup sequence. Let's go. Okay, now let's open up the engine and see what's inside. So first of all, we start with the engine tachometer. Uh, it's, it's a permanent uh, magnet alternator, this silver component. It sends a speak signals uh, during the start process, which is very critical for engine start control. And here we have the pneumatic uh, start valve. And uh, then here we have the pneumatic starter, the one that drives the accessory gearbox to turn the engine. And in this video, I'm just doing some routine maintenance to inspect the microchip detector to see the condition of the starter itself. So now let's look at the system as a whole. So that's the pneumatic starter valve. It's the one that controls the flow of air going to the pneumatic starter. That's the start valve solenoid and the wiring that goes to the EEC to control the starter valve. Let's go down the ducts. We come down here to the pneumatic starter, the one that does the main job itself. Accessory gearbox that turns the engine through the HP shaft. Okay, one more thing about the pneumatic startup valve. Let's go back to it again. When the electrical fails, you've got this manual override that you can use to manually uh, open the valve and start the engine. You need a bit of tooling for that. That's the EC and the ignition exciter box. So basically, that's the V2500 uh, starting system in a nutshell. Like and subscribe for more. Thank you.